joined by the 4x8 hitter meter relay team that set a new meet record. Nathan Behringer, Craig Allen Becker, Bradley Dennis, and Chase Molnix running 8-11 and some change. And let's uh, start off with the opening leg. Uh, Nathan, uh, good performance uh, tonight. Talk about your leg of the race here. Uh, yeah, so as a leadoff, I knew I just had to go out in first and get the, give the baton off in first. So that was my goal. And uh, we got that accomplished tonight. And the main thing is just to run my hardest each meet. And, Keep improving. Yeah, what can you say about the team? One of the team title as well. Everybody seemed to kind of be run their best yeah, the season. Everyone did great tonight. Uh, all three of the rest of the guys ran hard and proved their times and were ready to drop the hammer. All right, very good. Greg Allen Becker, you ran a 158, some change in your leg. You talk about your effort tonight. Yeah, so I was really proud. Of Nate was giving me a great leg there to just uh, help me get ahead and uh, get it to Bradley. And so the wind wasn't too much of a factor. I didn't know if it would be or not. And I just felt like I was really smooth and was able to get a good time. You ran by yourself, basically. How do you keep that, how do you keep going by yourself like that? Uh, the biggest thing is in practices, we do times. And usually those times are like based off of certain parts of our race. And so like we might do 200s that seem like, like the first part of a race or some 400s that simulate like our first or second lap. And so just doing practices like those and then also having people timing me at the 200 and 400 marks. Very good, congratulations, Craig Allen. Bradley Dennis, we talked earlier about your 1600 and uh, but it started off in that four by eight. Uh, talk about that 800 you ran in the relay. Well, you know, it's uh, this season I've been, I just started running eights this season and it really, I've been trying to bring my time down and I've been around 208, 210 for a while. And I think with, me, these guys have all been running eights their whole careers really and so it really helps a lot with Chase and Barron's being seniors they've done a really good job of showing leadership and helping lead me and Craig and even Craig's helped taught me a lot of things and sometimes when I get out of hand he keeps me on track a bit and so <laughs> I think that finally getting down to 204 really was good for me and I really hope I'm, I'm excited to see what we can do once we get to the Blue Oval. Hey man let's uh, go to Chase Molnix. Chase you were by yourself were, did you have the record in mind when you got the stick I didn't really know there was a meet record. We were just trying to improve our time because we don't get to run this quartet a whole bunch. So we were just looking out to come and improve our time. And then uh, Bradley and Barron's are just peaking right at the right time, which is what we need. Our whole team is really doing well at that. And Bradley gave me the stick at like 612. And that's when I knew I had uh, what coach says is drop the hammer, which is give it my all. And there wasn't many people to go after, but when there was guys to go after, I made sure I was going to get them. Yeah, and you were way ahead. You still ran a 158 some change, Chase. So how do you, uh... Uh, keep going like that we don't have any competition i think just over the years of running multiple eights i've just kind of grown that intro clock into my head so i kind of know where i'm at each two and then i also get a split uh coach will give me i split after the 400 so i kind of know where i'm at and then i just the last 400 i just try to do my best very good great race chase congratulations thank you